one of the coolest things to me about living in an old house is all the little things from the past. You like to imagine what color rooms used to be and what used to hang here and you know sometimes even the layouts have changed and you imagine what it looked like and um, one of the cool things about this house that I recently discovered is right here under the dining room table. Right down there, let's get a light on it, is a little round brass plate in the floor about the size of a silver dollar. And I always knew it was there, didn't really think much of anything of it. But recently in the basement ceiling, uh, I, I was doing some work and I found the underside to it, which was a little um, Bakelite piece with two brass contact strips on it and two very old small bell wires coming off of it, cloth covered. They'd been cut off from wherever they led to, but from doing a little more research on the internet, I found that this would have operated like a doorbell and it was for signaling servants to bring the next course into the dining room. So I had to get this working again because I thought that was just the coolest thing ever. And so I came uh, over with wires from underneath. Um, it just ran bell wire across underneath and up this wall in the kitchen and mounted a buzzer in the cabinet up there. Uh, mounted a transformer down in the basement just like you would for a doorbell and then I had to fabricate this button to go inside. See how there's two holes, one on either side of that? Originally you could have put a plug in with a cloth cord running up the table leg and you could have had a button mounted on the underside of the table, but I chose to uh, do the floor buzzer so that somebody sitting on either side of the table could push it. This is actually a, a piece from that put together furniture that you use an Allen key. I took a, it was just a long bolt that I got at Home Depot, ground it down, shaped it, and added a spring. And now when you push it, that buzzer goes off in the kitchen. So now you can activate it with your hand or with your toe, more likely. And I just think it'll be the coolest thing to show off at parties even if we're no longer fortunate enough to have servants living here.